All right, this is a, I'm gonna try doing this one from memory and see what we can make happen here. If there was ever a song that is just pure groove, it is that one. Hey guys, what's happening? Jeremy from Spirit and Groove here, and welcome to Wednesday Drummer Challenge. Uh, this week, we're going to make you give us your best Ringo. Why? Why? Why Ringo this week? Well, for all you drummers who don't know, May 26th was the 50th anniversary of Sgt. Pepper's Lonely Hearts Club. One of the most iconic pop albums of all time. Also... It was the album and Ringo's drumming on it that would usher in a whole new era in 1967 that would reshape how drummers are seen and how they can be creative inside the recording process. Now, I know in the drum community, we all kind of give Ringo a hard time. There's, you know, some speculation and rumors that John and Paul actually recorded all the drum parts after he left. Um, you know, people have said he was not a good timekeeper. People, you know, he wasn't musical. He wasn't a good drummer. He wasn't technical. Yada, 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 yada. Quit it. I'm going to take a firm stance for my company, Spirit and Groove, and say this. All drummers, past, present, and future, owe something to their craft to Ringo Starr. He has influenced you no matter what genre you play, what um, type of drum you play, from marching to orchestral to drum set to percussion. Somewhere in there I can guarantee there's some sort of degree of Ringo separation where he influenced what you're doing on the drums. So I think it's important that we all cherish Ringo and we cherish what he brought to the instrument and this week, I want you to show us how he's influenced you. And we're going to do that by having you record us some Ringo beats. Now, you can do drum covers, upload them on YouTube, or you could do like I did and just try to commit something from memory. Hopefully, yours is a little bit better. Doesn't matter. I just want you to share them with us. We're going to also going to try something new this week where um, we'd like you to copy the YouTube links of your videos and share them with us, bing, 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 right, right down, hopefully you can see that, you see that, right down there below the, uh, in the comments here on our Facebook page. And then I think this is going to be a great way for all of us just to kind of share how all these drummers look at one challenge and, and interpret it differently. It's a good building exercise for all of us. Also, if you want to, you can cut up those links and uh, those videos and you can share them with us on Instagram by tagging Spirit and Groove in the video. Um, if we dig it, we might repost that to our Instagram community. And if you get the most likes for the month and you're following us, we will send you any tea from our store for free. So there you go. That's two ways for you to share your videos with us, share your Ringo with us. So I'm going to let you guys get to it. I'm going to get back to um, practicing with some Ringo beats. And uh, I look forward to seeing how you guys hear a master.